every time you need data to make better decisions, you will need to rely on what is available to you. And well, if you're a big company, no problem. You might already collect a lot of data about your business, your customers, and so you can use that to whatever analysis you're doing. However, if you are a small business or even a student, you might probably just rely on whatever is available for free on the internet. But what if I tell you that there is a way to create your own data set from any website or online resources? And what if I tell you that I found a super cool tool that does exactly this for you with just a few clicks and no coding involved? Ciao guys, if you're new here, I'm Lore and I will leave here in the screen the agenda for today. And if any of this sounds interesting, make sure to stick around till the end because in just a sec, I will reveal the name of the very cool app that I found. So the way you can get the data from any online resource is called web scraping. And this is a process used by so many companies to get any information from the internet in a fast and efficient way. If you ever copy paste anything from a website, you're following exactly the same steps that a web scraper would perform but you're doing it in a manual way. In contrast, web scraping can extract millions of data points like number of likes, comments, tweets, pictures, and a lot of other stuff. And usually all of this data will be stored in a CSV file. And from that, you can do whatever it is that you need to do. With that said, the usual way to do web scraping is to use programming languages like Python and basically code all the instructions that you need to extract data from a specific website. And well, the tool that I found does all of this for you with no coding required. And so ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Listly. So Listly is a Chrome extension that you can install in your browser to have it ready whenever you need it. And well, in case you wanna check it out, I will leave all the links in the video description. And I think the best way to explain the power and features of Listly and really go to the so what of this video is to use a real case example to see exactly what we can do with this app. Now, let's say that I want to extract all the key informations about all the videos that my favorite YouTuber, Ali Abdal, published on his channel. So the way to do it is go to um, his YouTube channel in the videos section. And then what I can do is, um, as you can see here, all the videos, what I can do is go here on the top. I already installed Listly. I click on Listly Hall. And then I'm gonna select show hyperlink and then click on Excel. And this will uh, allow me to open an Excel file, which is uh, this one here on the screen. And as you can see, in only a few clicks, I have so many information in Excel. So the link of the video, the obviously the title. Um, if I scroll to the right, I have the number of views. I have the, uh, the dates of the video and so many other information. And now let's go one step further and let's say that I want to extract all the comments for all the videos of Ali Abdal. So obviously this is a task that would take me probably one month. And so if I select one specific video from his channel and then as you can see there are comments down, I can again uh, click on Listly, this time Listly part and now I can select exactly the part in the screen that I'm interested in. And so in this case, as you can see, different section, I'm gonna select, uh, try to select all the comments like this, then run Listly. Okay, so here we have all the comments that Listly have loaded from that specific video. But uh, what we need to do is actually using the auto scroll, which is another very cool feature of Listly that basically allows to automatically scroll down because then we can load all the comments. So, so I'm gonna scroll four times and also gonna wait two seconds to make all the comments load. I'm gonna save the settings and now basically we just loaded all the comments after four scrolling in that specific video. Now we need all the comments from all the videos in the channel. And so what I'm gonna do is actually using the Excel file that we extracted before, because this one has all the hyperlinks of the YouTube videos of Ali Abdal, and I'm gonna paste all of them over here, and then I'm gonna click on Submit. And now as you can see here in the screen, this is the job that I started. And so now we just have to wait for everything to be processed. And so after a few seconds, all the jobs are successful. And so this is the full list. 
And so now we can do um, actually grouping the ODXL together and then downloading. And then now it's exporting to Excel. And so as you can see in this Excel, I have now all the comments that people have shared for all the videos of Ali Abdal. And here I have the name of the account. I have the actual comment. Um, as you can see, all the <laughs> positive comments. And then obviously I have other columns that maybe uh, might need some uh, cleanup in case I want to use. But yeah, this is just uh, the result of a task that might take a month if done manually. And well, with that said, I will leave here on the screen some other very interesting ways to use Listly because yeah, now it's just a matter of being creative and really leverage on all the cool features that we explore together. And well, this is it for today. I'm very excited to have shared with you this tool, Listly, that I found because I'm already using it for some side projects. And as always, if you enjoy watching this video, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel so that we can help even more people in their data analytics journey. And well, enjoy the rest of your day. Ciao for now and see you in the next one.